So good afternoon, Meisner makers. It's time for this week's edition of So What Did You Miss? Over the last uh, couple of weeks, I've been talking to you about accessories, and each time you've been in for events and programs, we've talked about a special presentation that's going to happen the first week of December with Susan Beck. She's going to be coming to us for three-hour workshops, three to four-hour workshops, taking you through a number of accessories for your machine. Regardless of brand and regardless of machine model that you own, there'll be something in here for you. So here's a quick anatomy lesson and sort of a look at some of the types of information that you'll receive if you come to our accessory workshop in the first weekend of December. So for example, were you aware that every presser foot is designed specifically to do a certain job? And by looking at the formation of the foot and the bottom of the foot, this can give you clues as to how best to use the foot for other purposes. So this is a number one or an all-purpose foot. There's a very similar foot for all brands, makes, and models of machines. They tend to have a little slit on one side so that the thread can be slid um, easily underneath the presser foot. There's a little half channel on the bottom. So this is an indication that this type of a presser foot will work well for stitches that go forwards and backwards, but don't have a tremendous amount of bulk. A satin stitch is not going to feed beautifully through here because the foot is flat and stable. It's meant for straight types of stitches. Traditional straight stitches, zigzags, a stitch that doesn't have a lot of build up to it. So stay tuned for this and much, much more when you come to that accessory workshop in December. Registration is live and seating is limited, so be sure to visit our website today.